And welcome back to Sonic Colors. We're at the final part. I'm here on the Save Dev Select screen just to show you that general idea of how long it takes to understand it. So, this is before we do the final part of the end game. The end game, 15 20 minutes. So, roughly about five hours when you know what you're doing. And then even less time, you're just going from point A to point B without collecting everything. So, overall, a short game. The reason I'm doing this now is because once those credits roll, in the end, I say squat, <laughs> I'm going to bed, <laughs> give my final lesson now. Repeat, critical system failure. All attraction access is temporarily suspended. Please evacuate the park via the emergency exit ahead. This is all your fault. You're not wrong, Eggman, it is all my fault. That fool Sonic thinks he's won because he destroyed all my generators. Well, the mind control cannon is full enough for what it has to do. I will have the last laugh! The last laugh? How is laughing last special? Isn't that like being the slowest one to get the joke? Yeah, I laugh last all the time. People look at me like I'm an idiot. Forget about it. That's because you are an idiot. Eh, uh, hmm. You talking to me? Yes, I'm talking to you. There's nobody else here, so I must be talking to you. Why haven't we fixed your voice chip yet? Yo, quit busting my batteries over here. I've been working on it all day. What does that even mean? Oh, never mind. In a few seconds, it won't matter anyway, since the world will have only one thing on its mind. What's that, boss? <laughs> me. So this area is divided into okay, two acts and a boss, with one of the acts not really counting for anything, but whatever game. So let's get to start with Act 1. Hey Tails? Yeah? I got a bad feeling about this. Good, so it's not just me. When I feel the ground shaking under my feet and see plumes of dust rising and rubble tumbling and aliens running for their lives, yeah, I get a bad feeling. So, how about you and me make like Eggman's hairline and recede? Uh, this isn't joke time. This is running to the space elevator time. Sorry, couldn't help myself. We're out of here. Yeah, we're running now. Alright, Terminal Velocity Act 1. Not really so much as a world, 
because it's just part of the music park as a whole. But nonetheless, this is Act One of Two with a boss in between. So this act is really just running down the structure in order to get closer to the elevator. And there's no real goal ring, it'll just kind of end once you reach a certain point, so... For this first part, as you dodge these lasers from these uh, flying plants, that's all it is. Let me see. Uh, go. Alright, this is the first part. Next part, we have the motorbikes chasing you. You are fast. What the heck? <laughs> Why was that motorbug in particular fast? <laughs> that was weird. Alright, that was the third part. I mean, second part. Third part. This big guy. So, different from his appearance in Aquarium Park, you can actually jump. And this is actually all I'm going to do. And once we reach certain parts, I will start boosting. Right here. Yep. Alright. And because we're boosting, he actually can't reach us. So make sure you're destroying the motor box so you can keep up your boost energy. There you go. One of two S's that we still need. Why am I doing this? All right, and the other S is in the boss of Terminal Velocity. Time to bail! Is it there? It can't be! Leaving so soon! There are no lines, and I've saved the best rides for last! At least let me stab your hand so you can come back in! I know you're trying to be clever with this whole amusement park pun thing, but it's just coming off lame. So just say you're going to destroy us and stop embarrassing yourself. Curse you, Sonic! Not only do you foil my plans, but you foil my speeches as well! I work hard on them! No matter, I will destroy you, and I will be victorious! Is that better? Like a million times better. Thank you. This robot is special! He's powered by the energy from your little friends! He is invincible! So I'd say it's been nice knowing you, but it hasn't. I have to admit I'm a little scared. I don't think we can beat this guy. See you on the ground, buddy. Huh? Sonic, no! Just got one! As for you, all right, terminal velocity boss, Dr. Eggman. The only time you fight Eggman actually in this game, I do like that that uh, they saved him for last, you know, to make it more of a threat to build on this. Is. Despite itself, it's not difficult, but it is very climactic. I do like this boss in that regard. But really all you're doing is dodging his attacks and when he gets closer you're gonna pelt him with a bunch of homing attacks and then once you do that you actually get some boost energy and you can hit him twice. This is actually a requirement to get the S rank. And the other risk will be he has several different attacks based off the wisp. I think the only thing we won't see hmm I'm trying to think. Yeah, every... I guess really the only wisp you won't really see him use 
And maybe there is an attack where he does use it, but I've never seen it. Drill. Oh, this combination attack. I, this is rare. Okay, so yes, he'll sometimes combine with powers like that. But I thought he only did that after taking a certain amount of damage, but no, he did that really early. I've never seen him do that early. <laughs> I can't get over that. So yeah, after you hit him a certain number of times, then the the boss will actually, I guess, go into a pinch mode of some sort, and sometimes it'll just be faster. And then the music will change to an orchestral version of the main Sonic Colors theme. Ooh, almost boosted right into it. Laser. Yeah, I don't think Drill has a phase one attack. But yeah, this is extremely fast. And with this, believe it or not, this will be it. Come on, give me the rank I want. Give me the rank I want. Oh, you're starting on a D. You're not gonna give me that D? No, you're gonna be that. Yes, baby. <laughs> Love it. And that's it. All this is, baby. Ha! Suck it, internet. I bet you get something. Turned out the lights. At Eggman's incredible interstellar amusement park, you can feel comfortable knowing you are safety in our number one. Oh, shut up! Alright, Act 2 is basically just an escape sequence of really just jump when there's a hole and that's it. You don't even have to move up to the right. There's no ranking, no score at all. Just a matter of survival. You can't die, so yeah, I'm just pressing jump. Like that. You can ball through. But there's no real um, penalty to doing that. So yeah, I just wanted to show that off really. Yep. Yep. Once you pass a massive gap, you're basically in the clear. And that's it. Sonic colors, y'all. Hedgehog's gotta do what a hedgehog's gotta do. 
Great job, Sonic. Thanks. But I had a little help during that last part. for saving us. Uh, he says, you are welcome. That thing's translating pretty good. Yep, I finally got all the kinks out. We can talk to them perfectly now. <laughs> oh, great. He says, goodbye, my friends. I have to go. <laughs> Just when I got this thing working. Better late than never, buddy. Right on.
Faster, you idiot! Faster! Put your backsides into it! Technically, we don't have backsides, boss. I don't care! Just push! We have to hurry! I already have my revenge planned out, and next time I will not fail! Of course you won't, boss. Of course you won't. On the bright side, a certain someone got their voice back. I feel like my old self! All I want to do is talk, talk, talk! Hey, remember when we were chasing those little alien guys? What's up with those things anyway? They sure were funny looking! Ha <laughs> ha! You smell good though? Duh. What I wouldn't give for the maddening silence of space right about now. Sushi, hey, I heard they started using fish. Barbara, we didn't bring any with us. Not that we can eat it since we're robots, but we could have looked at it. I love looking at stuff. I love stuff. The fire show game was great. Hey, how did we get all this stuff to blow up like that anyway? Loved it. By the way, did you destroy something this time? Oh, sorry. Did you ever destroy something? Oh, sorry.